Well, good afternoon. Um, I've come up to um, a woodland um, which is um, by Woodbury Castle on Woodbury Common in Devon um, and I have come here specifically to try and get some shots of not sure if I'm going to pronounce this right fly agaric um, which are basically the the red topped mushrooms with the white spots um, so I'm quite keen on trying to get some shots of that I am um, got a shot of a mushroom in my garden last week which I'll then um, put up on screen now but I wanted to try and get some shots of those uh, specific mushrooms so I've come up I've heard uh, that they do grow up on Woodbury Common um, and possibly specifically here so I've come up to hunt around to see if I can see any <laughs> just been walking around for a good 20-30 minutes all around the edge of the, the woodland that's here um, through the middle a bit as well and just walking down back to sort of like an area close to where I'd sort of started um, just scanning the, the woodland floor getting a bit disheartened because I can't find any. Seen some other uh, mushrooms, but none of the ones which I'm after. And I've just spotted one through there. Look, you've done. I'm going to spin you around, but you might be, not be able to see it. And it's quite dark in there. He's in there, so I've got to try and uh, put my stuff down somewhere, get my camera out ready, and try and uh, crawl in there in case there isn't another one that I come across. Well, I've um, got some shots of one in there. Um, I didn't actually uh, vlog it because I was like in under, crawled through and under the trees. It was, it was quite dark. Um, I was sort of leaning at an angle so my back's hurting a bit um, I had to take a GoPro off my little gorilla pod and put the camera on that because I had to get that low um, had my 55 to 200 lens on um, so I'll uh, put up some of those images now and then I'm gonna go and try and find another location which is a bit more accessible maybe so anyway, here's the images. these little fellows here uh, so they're really small on a nice little mossy tree stump there um, so on the Fuji X-T2 I've got the 55 to 200 mil lens on and um, but what I've done is uh, put on a cooed close-up filter um, which allows me to get in a lot closer than I would do normally um, so I, I put the uh, number four filter on, um, which got me nice and close. I'll uh, put the shots up there.
I've been hunting around for more and I haven't found any yet so I'm really pleased I managed to find that one so far um, I was starting to get a bit frustrated and I had to remind myself about what I was talking about on my other video um, which I'll put a link up now um, head over and have a look at that one after um, but I've come across some more uh, little ones on the side of a tree trunk that's been sort of uh, fallen down and cut. So I'm uh, just going to set up here and see what I can get here. Right, I'm uh, in portrait here at the moment so I can uh, look along, um, but I'm in real close anyway. Now with, you can see how close I can get with the close-up filter, um, which I wouldn't be able to get nowhere near as close without that on it. So I've just taken one at f5 um, I'm going to just uh, take one off at f9 as well to have a look at and uh, I'm going to just stick the camera I think on uh, the gorilla pod so I can I want to get in under one of the others um, so I'm shooting up a little bit on it, so I'm gonna have a go at that. I'll be back in a second. I've just taken some from real low looking up, um, and I've experimented with. Uh, so uh, like F, F8, F11, F4, that sort of thing. So the uh, close-up filters are a nice cheap alternative to a uh, actual macro lens. Um, obviously. They don't do as good a job, but uh, they're not bad. Um, so I say, some of my shots here today are with them on, so you know, hopefully they're all right. Um, I just think I'm going to be tempted to get the 80mm Macro Fuji when it comes out. Uh, it's quite a pricey lens, though, so we'll have to see. But the I've got a mate called Kood, K O O D. Uh, I've had them for quite a few years and not really used them much. Um, and I think they come with a my set. There's a set of three, and it's a number one, a number two, and a number four, with four uh, being the closest. And you can also stack them as well to get in closer. Uh, all my shots today have just been uh, with a single number four on. But yeah, um, well, it's so long ago I can't remember how much they were. But if I can uh, find, if they're still for sale, that is, and I can get a link, I'll put it down in the description. Well, I'm. Uh, Really pleased I managed to find at least one of the uh, mushrooms I was looking for. Hopefully the shots are okay. There might be shroom for improvement. Sorry, couldn't help myself. Um, but yeah, it's been a been a good afternoon. Nice walk around uh, woodland. 
I found what I was looking for and got some shots of that and uh, plus some other shots as well so good afternoon um, hope you've enjoyed it any questions or comments or anything please feel free to put them in below uh, if you haven't subscribed yet please do uh, don't forget to hit the bell so you get notified of my videos when I put them live and uh, thumbs up if you've enjoyed it hope to see you again in the next one bye for now